Xiaomi 14 Ultra just released. Hello there, Xiaomi has released a new flagship in China shortly before the same device arrives globally, and today's chat is going to be about that. As you guys already know, this week, Xiaomi will be unveiling the Xiaomi 14 series globally nearly four months after introducing the first members of the series in China. Meanwhile, the Xiaomi 14 Ultra has been released in China with a starting price of 6,499 Chinese yuan, which is nearly 903 US dollars. To put it another way, the Xiaomi 14 Ultra costs 30% more at retail than the Xiaomi 14 Pro at 1500 Chinese Yuan. For context, this is how Xiaomi has priced its new flagship. The device with 12 GB RAM and 250 GB storage is going to be 6,499 Chinese Yuan. The one with 16 GB RAM, 512 GB storage will be 6,999 Chinese Yuan, while the device with 16 GB RAM and 1 TB of storage is going to be 7,000. 1,799 Chinese Yuan. Ultimately, the Xiaomi 14 Pro and Xiaomi 14 Ultra have the same display and are powered by the same chipset and display. So as a result, the latter has a 6.73-inch LTPO AMOLED display with a peak brightness of 3,000 nits and outputs at 3,200 into 1440 pixels at 120 hertz. Unlike the curved Xiaomi 14 Pro, Xiaomi has given the large display on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra a flatter finish. In addition, the Xiaomi 14 Ultra Sports and LPDDR 5X RAM and UF S4.0 storage in addition to a Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chipset. Well, one could argue that the primary distinction between the Xiaomi 14 Pro and Xiaomi 14 Ultra is the hardware of the latter's camera. However, Xiaomi also claims that the latter employs shield glass, which appears to be a competitor of Huawei's Kunlun glass. On the other hand, the Xiaomi 14 Ultra has 450 MP cameras on its back with a Sony LIT900 serving as the main sensor. Xiaomi's other rear-facing cameras, on the other hand, are dependent on the Sony IMX858, which it uses as an ultra-wide-angle camera with a 12mm focal length, and two telephoto cameras with equivalent focal lengths of 75mm and 120mm, or 3.2 and 5 times optical zoom, respectively. The Xiaomi 14 Ultra also features a 32MP front-facing camera. Then last Lastly, about the battery capacity, a 5,300 mAh battery powers the device, which is 8.6%, more than the Xiaomi 14 Pro's 4,880 mAh equivalent. For some reason, Xiaomi provides wired charging with a higher wattage on the 14 Pro than the 14 Ultra 120 watt for the former and 90 watt for the latter, but there's still 50 watt wireless and 10 watt reverse wireless charging available. Xiaomi offers the Xiaomi 14 Ultra separately, along with add on that transform it into a sort of hybrid camera. Regretfully, it's unclear if these will be available for the phone worldwide. That said, I'll be ending the discussion for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as well. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.